We've been talking about it for the last, oh, few weeks anyway. The Business Expo, sponsored by the Hilton Head Bluffton Chamber of Commerce. Huge event, biggest of the year. It was indeed the whole lot and much more. Charlie Clark was there. We're here at another successful Business Expo put on by the Hilton Head Island Bluffton Chamber of Commerce. And we've got the big guy here, Mr. Bill Miles, President and CEO. What a year. Things have changed up a little bit this year. Why do you think it's so popular? Why does it always remain so popular? Well, this is a great opportunity for the business community to come together and, and be able to show what they have, to showcase their products and services. And um, this is a, a great, a great year. We, we've enjoyed the changes, some different speakers this year, and we just finished a little bit ago with a terrific speaker from uh, New York. And uh, I think a lot of people learned a lot of things, and I certainly learned a lot. It was, it was great time, and it was well spent. It seems like business is back on the upswing. You know, the recession has passed, tourism is up this year, and we're seeing a lot of new businesses in this room today. Can you feel that energy? Have you talked to some folks around the room and what they feel the business community is doing these days? There's tremendous energy uh, in this room as well as on the island and in Bluffton. And, and you think about the all the positive things that have been going on and the tremendous growth that we've seen and the, the, the money that's been reinvested back into our community. It's just a time where the business community can come together and um, look forward to keeping that momentum going and kind of feeling the energy and, and continuing to grow the economy here. Let's talk a little bit about that because there is a renaissance that's happening. The renaissance of development, not just with properties, but with areas like new shopping centers, what Blanchard and Calhoun has done. What kind of impact do you think that has on reinvestment for the future for capital, private and public? Well, the rising tide lifts all boats. So we're seeing that tide rise and we're seeing a lot of boats that are uh, sailing very well right now. And we look forward to continuing to see that growth. I think the, the additional airline service that we've seen come in, the, the money that's been put into the properties, uh, different developments around the island, all that is coming together. And there's such a, a positive momentum as well as a, a belief right now in this community. And, and um, it's terrific to see. And, and we're looking forward to continuing to, to help it grow. Now give us the quick scoop and the quick update on Allegiant. I know Allegiant is now flying here. Are they happy with what they've seen so far? Allegiant has had a, a tremendous start uh, out of the blocks, just as JetBlue did. And, and uh, we're pleased to be able to pick up that Ohio market with direct flights and, and looking and working with them on maybe expanding some flights and, and uh, uh, expanding service as well as some additional routes. So a great, uh, a great, a great start. And we look forward to once again uh, seeing the success of that airline and con continuing to grow the seats that um, come into the market. Another great business expo. Back to you, Bob.